Hello everyone. I get these questions all the time. How to stay motivated and what do you do to stay motivated? So let's talk. And I'm gonna go out and limp and say that some of you won't like what I'm about to say, but I'm just being honest. So let's think what motivation really is. Motivation. It's a feeling. It's a strong desire to do something. It's based on emotions. And if you're talking about English, let's say you watch some videos and you got so inspired. Oh, she speaks so awesome. I can do it too. Mm, his story of learning English is so great. It sounds so simple. I can do it too. Oh, the advice is so great, I'm gonna use them. And you start learning and applying to all this advice, but then it's not working anymore. And you go and search for another incentive videos, people, whatever. But after a while, these things stop working as well. And you end up with a strong belief that perhaps it's not for you, that you are not gonna make it, that you can do it. Well, here, of course, it's good to know your why. Why do you want this? Why do you need this? And I'm sure you've heard this a thousand times, so I'm not gonna stop on that. And it's not only with English, it's almost with everything you that we start doing. But another thing that keeps people improving, progressing, working out, learning language, it's a decision. You've got to tell yourself, okay, today is the day I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna spend 30 minutes every day learning a language. Whenever I have time in the morning, in the evening, it doesn't matter, just do it. So my secret and not only mine is to make a decision and follow it. Follow it. At first it's cool and fun, but then it's hard. Sometimes it becomes a treachery. But then it becomes a habit, a good habit. Like when you start working out, at first you're so enthusiastic and motivated, but then you start almost hating it because it's hard and you're lazy and you start to talk yourself out of it. Sounds familiar? But then, if you overcome your laziness and lack of motivation and you know that in order to have a good, nice, healthy, strong body, you got to do it and you start enjoying it and then it becomes the habit, a great habit. And then you crave doing it, you need it, and you take pleasure in it, and it feels great because it's good for you. And you know that it's good for you. There is no magic solution, fortunately. We've got to work to accomplish something. And there is no one who's gonna come to you every day and motivate you. The truth is that only you is the one who can motivate you by saying yourself every single day okay today is the day let's do it and the most important do something at least something do you think it's easy for me to learn english and practice every day no it isn't sometimes i don't feel like doing anything although i love english and i enjoy learning it but i know my voice and i keep telling myself okay pull yourself together and do it and I'm not talking about only English. It has to do almost with everything that we want to do, but we think it's too hard. And it's never late to start learning or to start doing something they've never done before. And if you are thinking right now, oh yeah, all that sounds great, but I should have started learning language when I was in school or when I was 20 or 30. Well, no, it's never too late, unless you are dead, yeah, yeah, that is too late. Otherwise, you go do it. Challenge yourself, change something in your life. Be an example to your children, to others, because no one but you. Motivation and emotions are great. They wake up our desire to do something. They wake, make us stand up and start doing. But then we have to have this inner strength to continue. We have to learn the skill of a positive self-talk. We've got to talk ourselves every single day. I'm awesome. I can do it. I can learn this language. I can speak this language. 
I am not worse than someone else. I totally can and I will. And tell yourself something positive every single day because from my experience, this is essential. That's why I tell you at the end of my speech, stay positive. You've got to remember to praise yourself every single day because you are awesome. And if I can leave you with only one thought, it's this. Nothing and everything is a simple ball.